Tonight, two mid-state officers are being praised for their heroism after rescuing two men and their dog from a burning home. That fire broke out this morning on Oakmont Drive in Clarksville. News 4's Cameron Taylor is live outside the home tonight. Uh, Cameron, the officers were in the right place at the right time. Yeah, they certainly were, Tracy and Tom, and we could be talking about a different story if that first officer didn't get here when he did. Now, the house has extensive damage. You see that large hole in the roof, and tonight the officers are being called heroes, but they say it's just part of the job. A dark cloud of smoke covers a Clarksville home. Sergeant Johnny Ferguson remembers driving down Oakmont Drive. He was in the area looking for a domestic assault suspect. I, I've never, never seen fire. Uh, move that fast. It, it was just a matter of seconds before the whole front of the house was engulfed in flame. As soon as he pulled up, he started pounding on a window to get anyone's attention. He couldn't get near the front door. Hot enough where as the house was burning, you could feel the uh, heat. The two men who are roommates were sleeping at the time. Sergeant Ferguson's pounding woke them up and they were able to escape through the back of the house, but quickly realized their German Shepherd was still inside. We get, you know, we get situations all the time that you just go with what your mind tells you to do. Officer Thomas Walker heard Sergeant Ferguson on his radio. Officer Walker did not hesitate to go inside the burning home and rescue the dog. Everyone made it out alive. Had I been a minute or two later, uh, I don't think anybody, anything could have survived inside that house. Both lived up to the motto to protect and serve. For Sergeant Ferguson, it's about making a difference every day he puts on his uniform. Some aspects, some people say God puts us in the right place at the right time. Um, it, it just, the circumstances of this one, let me be in that, that right place at the right time. Back out here live, it's still unclear what started that large fire. We do know that the two men who escaped from this house fire, they're either staying at a hotel or with friends. Tom Tracy, 